and I'm going to have to put this in afterwards. If you look there, you can see there's a humanoid shape, head shape, score. There's no, <laughs> uh, there's no doubt about it. Um, that is a humanoid head with a nose, forehead, head, lips, everything. Cross. Um, there's a shape there. It looks like a lion type face with a paw out with what appears to be the, the base of an arrow in its hand or paw. See that? Looks amazing. Moving on. We've got oh the shape looks familiar, looks almost like a rabbit there. See the head and the base of the statue. It's got a mouth, a nose, an eye. Wire rabbit. Well, if you look further over, you can see another rabbit type creature. Not finished, but there you go. I don't think that's natural, it's artificial. And look there, you can actually see a deer head poking out of the ground. Remember this is a, a, an ocean bed or a dry lake bed. And those rocks in the centre are rectangular in shape. They are carved, you can see the carvings on them. <clears throat> it's all been carved, symmetrical in shape. If you look there, it's got a head, looks to me like it's a puppy, and it was going to have four legs. That's a carved rock at the side of it as well. Why a puppy? Well, oh, that's um, carved, you can see that. Oh, there's a puppy. There's no mistaking that. I've got one similar to that in my house. Back over towards the centre of the picture. There you can see what looks to me to be a pair of child's shoes or boots. What we've seen is amazing, but there's even more. Just moving down to the lower part of the picture, just there. And you'll see what appears to be a bone, very similar to a um, neck of femur, human bone. And at the back of it, you can see what appears to be a child's foot, fossilized child's foot. Just like the uh, fossilized, petrified bodies that were found in Pompeii. This picture alone, that had seen nothing else about Mars, would, would convince me of past life on Mars. And if this was on Earth, archaeologists would be falling over themselves to get working on the site. And now for the final bit, the exciting bit for me was finding this piece here. 
what you can see there is I believe the first Martian hieroglyph you can see it outlined head, helmet, body and even a weapon which is why I've called this the Martian soldier amazing I think it's the first one So, from this one picture, we've seen quite a few things that are not um, natural, they're man-made. What we can see here is the Martian culture.